Hi everyone, Macomb County Executive Mark Hackle. Just giving you a quick update on what's going on with the COVID related issues here in Macomb County. You know, if you think about where we started, the incredible surge and the issues we had to try to figure out how do we deal with this from the onset, whether it was PPEs, hospitals, uh, getting people in place with our health department to try to figure out how do we do with contact tracing and even testing. So how far we've come in over three and a half months has been pretty, uh, pretty remarkable. And uh, with that being said, we've had the support of our legislative branch, the Board of Commissioners, to continue what we call as our state of emergency here in the county but a state of emergency is to get control of the the issue if you will and uh, we've been able to do that uh, whether it's uh, working internally with our planning department emergency management uh, the folks that are dealing with our IT services um, you know trying to make sure that we have everything in place we've been able to do that and our health department has done a great job of dealing with the testing whether it's out uh, in the community internally within our organization or even some of the congregative care areas so we've been trying to figure out how do we continue to work with this even without a state of emergency. And a state of emergency basically is just to try to figure out how you bypass a legislative branch. We're going to continue making sure that we're controlling or containing this moving forward. And we have the ability to do that. And uh, working with our community partners, whether it's the businesses in, in the county itself, uh, the 27 municipalities that make up Macomb County, we've done a great job and we know we're going to be able to go ahead and continue to work through this issue. But we need continued support from the public. And the public has to weigh in on this by making sure they're following recommended CDC guidelines, whether it's wearing masks, keeping that distance, physical distance from other people, washing your hands, because we don't want to see a, a resurgence, if you will. We know there probably will be. There still continues to be this community spread, uh, but we're going to be able to work through that. Nothing will be like it was at the onset. We're going to be able to manage through this, and I think we're one of the first counties that have been able to do that, and proudly so. So I say that because on behalf of the staff in Macomb County, well, I tell you what, I couldn't be more proud of a county and try to figure out how do we get ahead of this and uh, making sure. It's not going to be eliminated, not until we have some type of a cure. Uh, when we see that happen, then there will be a lot more direction that will be given. But in the meantime, we need your support to continue through this. Things have changed. Things are going to be different. Shortly, we're going to be rolling out kind of the safety plans for Macomb County in and around the county, working with our local communities. And uh, you're going to see that guide, and we'll talk more about it. But suffice it to say, things have changed. And yet, parks are open. People are able to engage outdoors. Beautiful weather like we're seeing here right now. In fact, right behind me happens to be what they call the uh, Macomb drive-in movies. Uh, kind of a throwback to the days when I was a kid, the Mount Clemens drive-ins. Uh, people are able to come here. I think it's 200 cars uh, for each one of the shows they have. You can go to Macomb drive-in movies. They have a Facebook account that will show you the movies that are going to be played. And uh, for $20 a car, again, $20 a car load, so you don't have to worry about people getting in the trunk, you can have people come to this movie and kind of enjoy the day. So go to Macomb, uh, if you will, Macomb movie theaters or movie drive-in movies outdoors. You're going to be able to see that, uh, what they have as far as the movies that they're going to display and uh, enjoy that with your family. So there's a lot going on in the county. We're going to give you more updates as time goes on about the things happening in and around the county uh, as we continue. So again, for myself as well as our staff here in Macomb County, I want to continue uh, to thank you for your support and being a part of the solution, but more importantly, continue to keep you and your family safe.